it cools around once. chord shapes and then I'll take you through the strumming pattern and the rhythm okay so first chord you've got this D shape with your index on the second fret and you can drop your little finger onto the fifth fret here okay so you get this nice sound so you've got open fifth fret open second fret open open and that shape will occasionally open up by just lifting up your index finger so you've got two shapes right there, you've got your D with your index and your D without your index. Alright, next chord, we've got this sort of um, C suspended shape. So index, gonna bar these two. Okay, then you've got your little finger on it. And then we're gonna be hitting exactly that same note, but with your middle finger here. Okay, so you're leaving us this. And just muting out the the top and the high. So you get as your C suspended, I'm gonna slide it up two frets to your D suspended, and then we're back to our D. Next shape, real similar. We're gonna be coming in with the C suspended, okay, so one more time. Bar, middle finger, middle finger. Change that. Jump your little finger up onto this string. Drop your ring onto here and you get C major seven. Okay, you get that C major seven sound. And then finally, just slide your index down, one fret, give it a bar and open up your ring finger like this and I'm going to call this an E minor yeah, so. All right. and the reason I call it an E minor is because if you just put the E on the bass but we're just going to strip out the bass and just play it like this cool and then there's one um, Oh, there's a few more chords actually. We'll come back to the second time round. We're going to come back to this C suspended. Slide it up to to the D, and then I'm just going to give it. I'm just going to open the shape up. Just bar this whole thing, and give it a little little finger on this. Okay, so we've got that little shape. That we've got. Very last chords that we're playing, right at the end, we've got these two, which is your C, C major 7 again, and you're going to just slide that one down too. Quick recap of all the chords D, D open, C suspended, D suspended, D, D open, C suspended, C major 7, E minor, D.
All right, now we've got the chords down, let's check out the rhythm. Okay, so if I clap it out, we've got down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up, down, up. Um, I can play it real slow and say it along. Down, up, up, down. chord is using the index until the very last bit where you go up, down, up, and that's when you open it up, okay? So we've got one more time. Down, up, up, down, up, up, down, up, down, up. Okay, and then if you were to loop it, you get something a bit like this. Down. same rhythm on the next chords. spice up the rhythm is doing little things like this. just to practice them all right so we're going to do them um, in set places just to practice getting them down all right so i'll try and play the rhythm real slow so you can see where they fit in Sweet to be there. I'll give you one more, one more round. You get the idea. You could, you could drop them in at little different places. All right, let's get into some melody. I'm going to tab this one out for you, so um, you can just look at the tab, but I'm going to play it slow because I've got an accordion mate, I'm going to play it out and uh, 